for Hub5, we had our focus on team collaboration, the digital workspace. So let's talk a little bit more about collaboration, how things go. Now, at the office, you work with colleagues on a project. So what you would do is you get in a room, and there you work on creating a campaign, solving some customer issue, designing a university course, writing a policy brief, any of the kind of projects that you have that pull the people from different parts of the organization in one room. Now, online, you also have such a digital workspace, and that is, of course, Nexat Hub. Now, if you have such a project, you will need to first assemble a team. And so in Nextcloud, the project manager would create a circle that is a custom group in our contacts app and then add some team members. Now, the project manager can then choose how the team is managed. It can be directly under their control. They are the only one who can add and remove people. But they can also open up the circle so anyone can join or have an approval step in between. Can even delegate some of the management of team members to other people in the team so they can, for example, invite people or approve requests to join. Now, once you have a team that is managed, the next step is to create a space for collaboration. So you ask the system administrator for a group folder that is then assigned to the circle, and this way your team can together collectively manage the work. Now, these group folders will show up in the sidebar, so your team members can easily find the project or multiple projects they are working with, and they can easily say, okay, you know, these are my projects, here are the files, but also, on top of the folder, you have a nice view where you as a project manager can put information, to-do lists, even images, and of course, links to other resources. So, it's super easy in Nextcloud to add such resources. You can, for example, use the Smart Picker and very easily insert a link to our knowledge database. At the same time, Nextcloud also itself automatically brings together different resources using the related resource feature, where you can, for example, see that there's a chat room or a project board that is shared with the same group of people and that is related. And from each of those, you can then come back to the files that you have together. 